Hey guys, welcome to the channel. Hope you're having a great day. Strong Life RC here. And uh, just want to make this quick little video. I've got some projects in hand. Like I said before in other videos, I took the whole uh, year of 2020 off. Do with some health issues and stuff or whatnot. And uh, so I'm looking forward to 2016. Excuse me, 2000, what am I crazy? 2021. Maybe I need to take another year off. But anyway, 2021, I hope it's going to be a great year. This is the Death Star and Star Destroyer uh, kit, model kit that I picked up. It is by Bandai. And I picked it up at. Uh, Hobby Lobby. It was like 20 bucks, whatever. Very decent price and all. And I had that one. I'm looking forward to putting that in together. And then I had the Yoda that I bought off of uh, Mercha website. If y'all know what that is, I bought it off of there. And this is actually the uh, 1 6 scale. It also has a 1 12 scale of Yoda included. So I'm looking forward to putting that together. Um, when I bought this, I the uh, the advertisement was showing that it was uh, already put together, and I thought it would come together. But then when I got it, it come in as a this model kit. But that's okay. Sorry about the glare of the light there, but uh, looking forward to creating some good things this year. Some more content. I did post a video up yesterday, uh, Saturday, of. Uh, frozen uh dry falls when it was frozen hope y'all go back and watch that i did it in slow motion and i posted the video and it's a pretty cool place i go up there a lot it's up in highlands north carolina just uh about an hour and a half away from me down here in georgia but here i want you to look at this uh what i have here and i'm really excited about this guy here and i purchased this at a little flea market and uh, he is made of all metal, but his cape and all that he has on or his clothing here is rubber. But the rest of him, his chest and all, his head and his legs and arms are all metal. So I thought that was pretty cool when I bought it at the flea market. And uh, I spent two hours debating on whether I wanted to buy him or not. And he actually stands about six and a half inches and see that it's about six and a half if you look at it right it's about six and a half inches it come with this base i'm not going to sure i probably won't display him on this base when i get finished the project with him but i thought this base was pretty cool because it's just says star wars so i may just go back and paint this in um either white or red and uh, one other cool thing that he has with him. Let's see if I can get him back up on his stand here. Well, not. Anyway, one other cool thing is his lifesaver. And it is pretty long. And it does come in half, as you now see. But uh, I'm planning on doing a project with him. And uh, I'm planning on uh, lighting up his lifesaver. I still think it's going to be really cool. And I hope y'all stay tuned for that video when I get it done. And of course, I got some other Star Wars projects that I've got going on. I got a little TIE fighter here. I got a little X-Wing fighter here. Um, I, bought, I ordered these off the of internet, off of eBay. And I have another X-Wing starfighter here I'm going to put together. It was $9.99 at uh, Hobby Lobby's. It is by uh, Bandai. And also the advanced TIE fighter. I got uh, projects for that. I'm very cool. I like my RTD2. I got him for, for a quarter at the flea market. Um, I'm looking to get a CP30 to go with him. I do have a little Yoda here. I gave a dollar for him at the flea market. Very cool. I got projects signed up for him. I do have this Darth Vader. And I do have another one that's the same size as Darth Maul. 
and I cannot find that Darth Vader anywhere, but it's here at the house somewhere. And also, I got a Luke Skywalker. Got the black hand. Uh, he didn't come with a lightsaber, so uh, we're gonna we're gonna build him one. Uh, I got this old stormtrooper here. I got a bunch of stuff. Not a whole lot, but I got a bunch of stuff that I've been collecting here lately. And this is one of the cool things that I picked up. Let me push this stuff out of the way. One of the cool things that I picked up was this bad boy right here. This speedster. And I gave I gave two dollars for this thing at the flea market. And I'm very excited about that. And may uh do something with it sometime. Sorry, I cannot find my phone stand, and I'm doing a doing all this one-handed. So I think he looks like he might be a little bit too big to ride this. Oh, there we go. He does look a little bit big. <laughs> anyways, I thought that was pretty cool. I had to buy it when I saw it. But anyway, guys, so thank you for watching. I hope to see y'all this year on my channel. Come by and support the channel. Leave a comment. Say hey, whatever. Uh, give me some ideas. Tell me what you think. Really cool about this dude. I gave 50 bucks for this guy. I thought it was a pretty good deal. But anyway. So, uh, yeah. Oh, this is my uh, Millennium Falcon. Check this thing out. I paid three bucks for this thing at the, at the flea market, guys. Three bucks for this thing. Let me show you just. Let me show you the scale of this thing. Mm, let's see. Pour the tape on it. Oops. This thing is actually I'm on twenty. Oops, let's get it. It's actually twenty eight inches. There we go. It's freaking cameras. When it's small, it's twenty eight inches long. I thought it was pretty cool. I get like I said, I gave three bucks for it. Uh I got a project for it. Very cool, very cool. Yeah, so I'm very pleased with that. And I've had this for a couple of years and and I display it over here on that shelf. And I just put the cardboard there in front of it because it's got DVD, so I just put the cardboard there in front of it. See, Drone Life, that's my sign, Drone Life RC. That's some of my RC cars. A few of them. There's my new airboat I bought up in Pennsylvania. Name, I need to hire a maid. <laughs> excuse the excuse the mess, y'all. That's my Georgia Bulldogs, go dogs. Anyways, I'm excited about this thing. I really like this thing. This thing is pretty cool. They're gonna go back and put some weathering on it to make it look a little, you know, used and rustic and all. And this is another thing I found at the flea market for again, amazingly, three bucks. And it's missing a couple of parts, but uh it's this tie bomber right here. Ain't that cool? So it is missing a hatch. I need somebody to uh where can I get a hatch for this thing, guys? Um somebody print one or can I buy one off of eBay? I'm missing a hatch and I'm also missing the other landing gear there. As you see. So if anybody can point me in the right direction of where I can find that at, these missing parts. And I actually Saw a guy on the internet that was actually selling one of these. Uh, I saw it the other day and I can't remember where it was at, but it was either on Facebook or it might have been on eBay. But a guy was selling one and he had the same exact one and the same exact parts was missing. His hatch was missing. Um, his other landing gear was missing. So anyway, if you know where I can get uh, these replacement parts, let me know, guys. Ain't that cool? I'm hoping to get, I like to get an X-Wing fighter this size. And I saw one at the flea market and I passed it up and now it's gone. I should have, should have got it when I saw it. Ain't that thing cool though? All right, guys. Thank you for watching the channel. Stay tuned this year. We got a lot coming. Oh, and this, <laughs> check out my table. My table, guys, the table that I'm, that I'm doing this video on is an old white table. I found this laying on the side of the road. And so when it was, you see right up under here, it was like all scruffy looking. And I had this 
and I got this card stock at work. Brought it from work. I work in a, a distribution center. This card stock come in and on some pallets that was packed in on some pallets and uh, got that. And I think <laughs> that did good for just covering up that, that table, making it, refacing it. All right, guys, I'm out of here. Thank y'all for watching. Y'all have a great day.